Well, I think crypto is, is, is just a fake money, you know. Somebody is sitting somewhere and mining the money, like in, 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 in the Middle Ages, you know, and, 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 then, and, and then using them. It's, it's, I think it's no government, so no government can accept it because it's not under the, any government policy regulations, central bank regulations, how much money issued, you know, how they spend, uh, whether they pay any taxes or whatever. They can't control it. But, so that's why the, many governments are trying now to introduce the, the official uh, digital uh, ruble in the case of Russia. We know that probably Chinese are more advanced than any other nation. So uh, in, in Russia, we had a long discussion with central bank, between banks, and uh, because there was originally concerns that central bank will take some business uh, from the bank. Banks by 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 inviting clients directly. Now we we, we found the scheme when, when the clients actually still will remain will stay with, with the bank. So when when transaction will be done by the central bank, and I think we we now we now set um, a, a joint group, and we are planning I think to launch uh, the test uh, next year uh, as soon as next. But it will take a couple of years probably to introduce it in full. And, but it's inevitable. Inevitable. The uh, the whole world is moving to a digital uh, world. Uh, and the uh, currency is not uh, excluded from this process, of course. In your view, should those in the United States who are having these conversations be concerned about that move to digital currencies, that it could undermine the status of the U.S. dollar as the world's reserve currency? I mean... We're not concerned about undermining dollars, you know. It's, uh, we, think, we think that definitely some changes uh, need because, because the world is changing. Because the, I think today transaction in dollars is for the first time less than 50 percent. You know, we have China economy growing and, and so on and so forth. But uh, it's definitely, and many more things, needs a... Uh, uh, regulations on an uh, intergovernment level, and I think that's one of the areas when we also can uh, can communicate and talk to uh, Americans and, uh, and other, because it's, it's it's a global problem, you know, uh, what to do with this currency, how they will operate. Uh, I think that's that, that's what we need. And so a lot of mavericks involved, including Elon Musk, when it comes to the cryptocurrency space. Mm -hmm. I don't know much about, uh, there's more about cars, we know, and it's a great car, I think, but still, unfortunately, not very common uh, because it's, it's still very expensive. But the currency, I mean, most of the reporters say or comments that, so that it, will not, it will not go too far, you know, like other currencies, which are now more uh, popular among the population.